busy around here, but I do want to get back on a schedule of making videos for you guys. I think it's just so much fun to share the farm and what we're doing here. Today was kind of a bittersweet day. We said goodbye to Pepper's little doling. So Pepper had two kids this year. She had a doling and a buckling, and the buckling already went to his new home um, earlier this week. And so today her doling went home. She was probably, don't tell the other ones, but she was probably my favorite baby this year. She just had a really spunky, silly personality and she was always jumping on me and wanted to say hello. And so she was probably um, gonna be the hardest one to say goodbye to. But I know she's going to a great, great new home. She's gonna be so loved and Honor knows it too. She came along with me to help, didn't you, honey? I know, I miss Daisy too. So her name is Daisy. So she went to her new home. I didn't get that on video because I really didn't know I was gonna be videotaping today. This is kind of just random, but I thought it would be fun to do a little video today because I actually have to milk her mama tonight, I'm thinking, because she's probably gonna get really full without um, her baby with her. <laughs> and it's gonna be the first official time of me milking, you guys. <laughs> So I've done it like a little bit just to relieve um, Peachy before, my other goat that had babies recently, but not like a for real true milking session. It was just a little bit just to like relieve her. So that's going to be really interesting. I thought maybe if I have time, I'll bring out the camera and you guys can laugh at me trying to do it my first time, especially on Pepper because she's spunky and I don't think she's gonna like it. In the meantime, I have to run around this house and get cleaned up and ready for our friends coming over tonight for dinner. Um, they just had a new baby and we are inviting them over for some food tonight and to get out of the house and let their older son play with my youngest so that they can just hopefully have a relaxing evening. Um, with our family. So I'm just gonna run around and clean. And before I know it, it'll be chore time. so much better today but I noticed maybe mm, a week ago a little less than a week ago that it was like runny and watery and she couldn't open it all the way or it looked like it was at least hurting to open it all the way I figured it was probably either pink eye or just some irritation of the eye of some kind so I've been using this it's teramycin it's just like a antibiotic eye ointment. And I've been doing this two to three times a day. It actually recommends more than that, but with my schedule right now, that's about the best I can do, honestly. Two to three times a day, I've been doing it for maybe four days now and her eye looks almost completely better. It might be still just a little bit reddish looking up on the top there. She might've even just gotten like an eyelash stuck in it or something but it looks much better than it did before. I mean, she couldn't even hardly open that eye before. So hi, Cotton. You saying hi? You saying hi? <laughs> so I just gave her a little extra snack. Oh, bless you. Gave her a little extra snack, checked her eye, put some more ointment on it, trimmed her hooves while she was up here, brushed her out a little bit. She's good to go. So we did that today too. She's loose when she does that. No, no. You do just look at you, just. Yeah. I think we've been redone 
better when they show them helping. Show them helping. So this is totally not the right way to milk a goat, guys, but she has such tiny teats. <laughs> she put her foot in it. All right. So we're just doing our best. I'm getting really mad because she doesn't have any more food. Honor, do you think you could get her a few more sunflower seeds? Yeah. Yes. So I'm gonna go get her some more sunflower seeds. Let's see here, what do I scoop it with? This? Okay, I got a scooper, as you can see. I'm gonna take my scooper. All right, I have got the sunflower seeds. Hey girl, no, no. No, don't bite the cup. All right, I just gave her some more food. Now back to the milking part. Terrible. It went a little bit better than I thought it would. Um, like I said in the videos, she just does not have the easiest udder to milk. But we got a little bit of milk and she stepped in the bowl. So <laughs> we're not gonna use the milk. But um, I would say our first time doing it went okay. Not great, not terrible. And uh, we'll do it More again. Like the medium More like medium. We'll do it again in the morning. Oh, we're gonna go up this way, guys. It's raining, so sorry if I'm making a weird face or if the camera looks funny. Um, but yeah, we got a little bit of milk in there. And now it's time to start dinner for our guests coming over tonight. Wait for you? Okay. See you next time on Little Maid.